Hello friends, running kimono. So kind of a different take on the video. We're going to start at the Home Depot where a lot of outdoor exterior stuff like um, inflatables, lights. I think I even saw some Christmas trees and other little doodads for the holidays. Whatever they have left is 50% off. So that's really cool. Um, I'm not sure if you guys got the full story, but um, a couple days ago I got some really inexpensive lights at Lowe's, 75% off. I probably got like $150, $60 for $40. And um, we had a couple inflatables in our backyard. If you've been with me for a really long time, you know we had a really big Hello Kitty one and a Santa and then a snowman. All of the legs of these inflatables broke or the fan got busted in Hello Kitty. And then um, the Santa that we had just wasn't as spectacular. So um, I was looking for like a larger display that was one thing, just not like a hundred little things, <laughs> you know, and I found this. This was the last one. It's a 12 foot Santa sleigh scene and it's so cute. And it was $64.99. So the original price point, it was like, you know, just about 130 bucks. Um, and it's just one larger contained um, scene. And I think the Santa was so adorable. And even though the clearance started today, which is uh, Thursday, the 23rd, guys, there was very few inflatables left. So these are going like hotcakes. Home Depot, 50% off. If you think that's a good price for you, I would go right away. Okay, so over at Walmart, I kind of fell into a deal today. I am not a really big fan of Green Mountain Coffee. I've had it on occasion and I thought it was okay, but this kind of caught my attention, which is a holiday blend. I like any sort of spicy coffee, so this is something I would want to try. And it was $3.88. The original price point was $12 and some change. That's 75% off. So this is the UPC right here. If you want to go to this website specifically, brickseek.com, type in this UPC along with your zip code and you can see what the price point is at your store for this specific coffee. And again, this is for a Keurig. It's the 24 count. So I paid that $3 and some change back. As you can see, Shopkick is giving back 2,000 points, which is $8. So it made this free plus a four dollar and twelve cent money maker couple things about the Shopkick app uh this is once per account and say you wanted to buy like two or three you have to buy them all on separate days to qualify for that rebate but i was able to get it the one time and i'm very delighted to get this as a money maker Okay, so this is the Holiday Blend by Starbucks. It's 50% off. The 22 count, I think this was like, how much was it? It was really expensive at Meijer. It was like 20 plus bucks. So to get it for $7.99, I'm all about that. Here's the UPC for the, um, the Holiday Blend. And this is one of these products. They had it in stock and then it was gone. Uh, people were buying it like crazy. And I think for a 10 count of this, it was like $7.99 at my Meyer. So it is not cheap. And then there's also that Pumpkin uh, Spice. Sorry, I, I just kept talking about Holiday Blend. Here's the UPC for the Pumpkin Spice. And I think this was like $8 and some change if you like a little bit of a Pumpkin Spice flavor. I prefer like Holiday Spice coffees um, as as opposed to the, the pumpkin spice, but it is your choice. I would really look high, look low, look all over that coffee section. That's where I found all of these. And then also in uh, Green Mountain, I found this, which is the uh, cinnamon sugar cookie. I don't believe there was a Shopkick rebate, and this one was $6.57 from $13.14. So a little bit of savings right there, 50% off. And here is the UPC for this guy, if you wish to look for it on BrickSeek's website. If you were an avid uh, shopper, I'm just going to share something with you guys. Even in my little town, um, at Walmart specifically, a lot of the sections with the Christmas stuff, like food or like even like the, the ladies Gillette shaving kits, a lot of this stuff is getting cleared. Like people are really going above and beyond this Christmas. I think it's the second year of this pandemic and people are just feeling a bit more. They want to give a lot more this year. But I'm noticing that even shelves with stuff or just like completely empty. And I tried to find like where the, the employees were staging other things for the 26th uh, when things go 50% off over at Walmart. And I got to tell you guys, it was there wasn't a lot left. So I know that uh, people have been posting on social media that, you know, some of their stores are just putting up uh, Valentine's. Valentine's Day displays is changed that quickly. So yeah, um, even the fact that they're doing a little bit of clearance before Christmas Day, I'm all about that. So if you love, um, you know, finding clearance for certain items, uh, like I was talking about like Home Depot and Walmart with this coffee, you might want to look high and low even before the Christmas Day. 
Okay, so this next one, a little bit embarrassing, but a little bit funny. $2.88 for these three counts of the Jurex. There is an Ibotta rebate for $3 back, so it makes it a complete freebie. I know that Shopkick also has a rebate back for this. However, it's for the 10 count, and this is the three count that we're purchasing. Here's the math, guys. Two of the Jurexes are $5.76. You'll pay that out of pocket. Get $3 back twice from Ibotta, making this free plus a 24 cent money maker. Great little stocking stuffer or great little gag gift, however you want, you know, just right before Christmas. Um, and this deal works out beautifully, so I'm very delighted to get uh, two of these. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.